Okay, what's your thought on Muslims? Um, not to be racist, but when I do see one, I do think in my head, like, if I'm in a train by myself and they got a, like, a outfit on like that, I'll think that they're gonna blow up the train, but not. <laughs> oh my god. That's the same I think about any other group of people. Uh, is it good, good or bad? Good. Muslim and Islam, they don't scare me anymore, no. Oh, that's good. You said anymore, so used to scare you before? They would, yeah. They would, when I was a kid. Well, to me, I kind of believe that they are kind of weird, but what they say about what they did with um, 2001, what happened in 9-11, I kind of don't believe that it was their fault. I actually believe that it was the government's fault. My thoughts on Muslims, I think that they're really strict. No, not scary. I think there are many scary Christian people as well. <laughs> That like Muhammad was a prophet and Jesus is a prophet. I, I don't feel one way or the other. That's great. What about you, ma'am? Same way. It doesn't matter to me what about it. Aren't they a little scary though? Not necessarily. I think it's no different than any other sect. Black, white, red, yellow, Muslim. They're all, you got good and bad in all of them. I respect these people, yes. Their, their thoughts and their religion is... So there's nothing scary about them? No, nothing at all. Yeah, I lived in the Middle East for four years and they're amazingly good people. They just happen to follow a religion that's different, that's different to mine, the same as Jewish people follow a religion that's different to mine, or Greek Orthodox people. They're just following a different religion, you know? And as I said, unfortunately, there are minority lunatics in, in every religion and the perception needs to get changed that that is just the minority of people and it happens in all different religions all over the world, you know. Uh, I don't have any problem with Islam or any of its followers. That's good, so when you hear the word Islam in the media you don't feel any fear or hesitance to love it? No, I don't. I don't have. I don't think it's fair for us to judge an entire religion just based on the actions of individuals. What's your thought on Muslims? They're fine with me. No, it isn't because in our place, in Germany, there live a lot of Turkish Muslim people, and that they, they are together. They were together in kindergarten, and that worked very, very well. Another, another religion that we respect. Uh, I have a couple of Muslim friends. At least my friends, from my experience, I think they are very, uh, uh, very educated, very polite. Just because a person is a Muslim and somebody else is a Muslim doesn't mean they do the same thing or have the same exact. They're not, you know. People get lost along the way. There's stuff that goes along with it. I mean, you see all of this stuff. That stuff's there, but it doesn't, it, it doesn't color the, what I think of people. I don't know if I have like a an answer. I mean, they're just people. My best friend is actually Muslim, so I'm very open to it. Yeah, I'm not like opposed to Muslims. I don't. Know. So when you hear the word Islam, you're not afraid or anything? No, not at all. That's really cool. So if you had something to say to a Muslim right now because of the hate they're receiving in the media, what would you say? Uh, I, it sucks and it shouldn't be like that. And I'm sorry. <laughs> I appreciate it. You don't have to apologize. No, I mean, I'm not apologizing. I didn't do anything, but yeah. it sucks. I mean, I'm sorry that you guys have to go through that. If you had a Muslim right now, what would you say to him right here? I'm really sorry for the way our media participates so openly in the process of stereotyping any religion, now particularly Islam. We should be talking about the government, we're talking about Islam. They, they, at the end of the day, they're not robbing from us, they're not stealing from us, they're not doing all these things to us, you know. So would you trust a Muslim person? Of, of course, anybody. Depending. Every man is had to be judged based on the content of the character, not the association. So then, if that was so, then I should say all white people is racist. They're people, they should not be discriminated or uh, Intolerated. With me personally, I'm I'm in the rave scene, so like we accept everyone. And our basic outlook on life is don't judge anyone before you get to know them. I like the Muslim people because they hold to a code of ethics that a lot of people don't actually. You know what I mean?